Good morning, Audacious Church. It is good to be with you this morning. Um, let us know in the chat where you were watching from. My name is Laura um, and I just have a verse to encourage you with this morning, something that God has been speaking to me this week. Um, and then I just wanna give you a quick challenge because we all love a bit of a challenge in our day. Um, and then I would love to pray over you and encourage you into your day. Um, so the verse that I will be reading over you this morning can be found in Psalm 28, and I will be reading from the Passion Translation, and it's verses seven to nine, and it says, My strength, Yahweh is my strength and my wraparound shield. When I fully trust in you, help is on the way. I jump for joy and burst forth with ecstatic, passionate praise. I will sing songs of what you mean to me. You will be the inner strength of all your people. Yahweh, the mighty protector of all and the saving strength for all your anointed ones. Save your people whom you love and bless your chosen ones. Be our shepherd leading us forward, forever carrying us in your arms. I love this version. I love this verse. It is been one of my grab hold of when I'm having a tough day, a very challenging day, to remind myself that um, God is my wraparound shield. And I love the way in the Passion Translation that they um, describe that God's love is wraparound. God's protection is wraparound. And so that's what I wanna encourage you with today is that God has wrapped himself around you and he is protecting you. He is going forward before you. He is behind you, he is beside you. He has got you in your day. And what I always feel challenged by, but something from this verse um, that really sticks out to me is when it says, when I fully trust in you, help is on the way and in other versions it says when my heart trusts in you you come through for me um but it's a heart issue it's do i wholly and that means exclusively with all of your heart with all of your soul your being do you exclusively and fully and wholly trust god in whatever challenge you're facing and I think that is a heart surgery question. I think there can be times when you say you believe God. Yeah, I believe that he's coming through for me, but you're not feeling it. And when you don't feel it, what you have to do is just keep going back to the word of God, reading his promises, reading his, like, about his faithfulness. It can be seen throughout the whole Bible. Um, and all the stories in the Old Testament, how God came through for them time after time. My favorite um, book to go to is Job and also to the story of the Israelites. Um, just because you see God's faithfulness shine through no matter what the challenge and whatever they throw back at him. And so just as God gave Jesus to us and he wholly trusted Jesus into our hands, into the world, I would love to encourage you this morning um, if there is something you are struggling to trust God in, then just go back to the story of Jesus. Go back to how God entrusted Jesus into our hands when he um, was born into this earth. So um, that is my little encouragement for you this morning. Just do a little heart surgery. If there is somewhere you're not seeing miracles, that you're not seeing breakthrough, Ask yourself the question, do I really, really trust God in this or am I just saying it? Um, go back to the word of God, uh, build yourself up, encourage yourself um, in the word of God, read his promises, pray, pray, pray. And I know that God will come through for you. Um, so if you don't mind, I would love to just pray for 20 seconds and then I will love to let you go on with your day. So Lord, yes, we just thank you. We thank you for the gift of your word, the gift of your wraparound presence, Father God, that we can just fully put ourselves into your care, into your trust, um, and just know that you've gone before us in our day. You, you're behind us, you're beside us, 
Um, you're holding our hand up in victory. Jesus died on the cross for us. And we carry that with us every day, Father God, that we have the victory just as long as our hearts are fully entrusted into yours. And so, Lord, I just thank you and I praise you. I ask that you, Holy Spirit, would you lead those today um, who are feeling challenged by this word? May they just have a bit of heart surgery. May you work through them with that. Um, and yeah, Lord, I just thank you. I thank you for every single person um, watching this devotional. Would you just bless their day? In Jesus' name, amen. So good to be with you this morning, church, and have a wonderful day.